Hey guys, Faith Freak 59. As you can see by the last video, guys, I do have my first Faith 14 squad builder, and we're using Foothead to do the squad builder. As you can see up here, it says Foothead, and as you can see, um, they've actually upgraded their site to a FIFA 14 site now. So basically, all these cards in here have been confirmed 95% by EA. So um, all these stats, you know, they are fully like confirmed, except for a few that may change, but. On the most part, these are confirmed stats, and we'll get into the first team that I will be using in FIFA 14, and I'll be running the 4-2-3-1 formation, a very reliable formation throughout the um, FIFAs, throughout FIFA 10, FIFA 11, FIFA 12, FIFA 13, and hopefully in FIFA 14 as well. And I forgot to mention FIFA 09 as well, but um, I didn't play FIFA 09 because I started off in FIFA 10, and we'll get into the first player, and at goalkeeper, we have Marchetti, the all-reliable beast. And interesting story is this, this guy used to be quite a low rated goalkeeper in FIFA 12 but he's had two fantastic seasons. Last year he got upgraded to an 83 and now he's an 84 and he looks like a very nice card and I'm looking forward to trying him out. And we'll move on to the right back now who is Abate as you can see we're just typing up his name and we're adding him into our team and look at that pace, 93 pace and some are very nice you know defending stats, dribbling stats and decent passing along with that. and. He does look like a very nice card and he'll fit in very nicely into some uh, Serie A hybrids with like, you know, BPL players and stuff like that. And the first of centre backs is, um, we'll slot in, uh, what's his name? I, I know his last name is Jesus. Oh yeah, it's Juwan as you can see and he is a non-rare card. And um, if you want to tell how to, you know, tell between the non-rare cards and the rare cards, as you can see over here with Marchetti, he has like this badge symbol, um, this crest. But um, at the top, if they're non-rare, it will just be flat. And Juan is a non-rare card, but he does look like a fantastic non-rare card and quite an underrated player. And he does look like the next David Luiz. Um, some very similar stats to David Luiz, except for David Luiz has quite better, you know, dribbling. But he looks like a very nice card and a promising player for the future. And our next centre back is a player, a very interesting player. As you can see, we're just typing in his name. Um, yeah, he just disappeared. Caceres over here. This guy actually used to be a right back in um, FIFA 13 and he's actually moved off to the centre back position for Juventus because he did play there last season a lot of the games and he looks like a fantastic card and um, he's actually going to go for a lot of coins and he'll be a good pairing with Chiellini on this side but I'll, obviously at the start of the game we're not going to have enough coins to buy Chiellini because he'll probably be going for about 60 to 70,000 coins and the left back we're going to put into this team is um, Rafael Martino as you can see and this guy um, a very interesting story with this guy he actually used to be in the Serie A B and he used to be a left mid in FIFA 13 but as his team got upgraded to um, Serie A last season um, now he's a left back actually and he does have some very nice uh, stats there but I think he's more of an attacking player than a left back and we move on to the first center, mid, center defensive mid sorry and on the left hand side we're going to go for De Rossi, the absolute legend, as you can see slotting him into our team. And he has actually been downgraded by two ratings to an 84 instead of an 86, but his stats are quite nice still. And the next one, um, the next player of this team, the next CDM is Paul Pogba. And um, my friends probably know how much I love this guy, he's an absolute beast and um, he's actually progressed very well throughout the years. I remember he used to be a 55 rated card on FIFA 12 and now he's been upgraded to 79 and the camp position will be having Sal and this guy used to be um, a silver last year on FIFA 12, FIFA 13 sorry and he was um, quite a favourite player of Tani. if any of you guys know who that YouTuber is, a very nice YouTuber he is and this guy looks like an absolute beast and I'm looking forward to using him and for the first of camp positions on the left hand side we're going to go for um, an interesting player as you can see, we're just putting him into our team. I spelled his name wrong. It's Makazel. And this guy actually used to be a 5-star skiller in FIFA 12. But unfortunately, um, he has 4-star skills in this game. But he looks like a very nice silver card. And he'll be used in a lot of Brasilva squads, I do believe. Some very nice uh, you know, stats there. And I'm looking forward to using him when the game does come out. And hopefully he doesn't go for you know too much. And the next camp position we'll be going for is... Um, who are we going to go for, actually? Wait, let me just um, take a look. I do have it on my history over here. Um, yeah, Rubinho, Rubinho. So um, Rubinho has actually been downgraded quite a lot this year. He used to be an 84 rated player, I do believe, in FIFA 12. And then he got downgraded to an 81. And now he's been downgraded to 75. 
and he's lost his five star skill moves also i don't understand ea's logic on that part just because um even if a player doesn't you know like perform that well they obviously don't lose their ability to do um you know skill moves and stuff like that and the striker to finish off this team you probably already saw it before but we're going to slot in balotelli the beast a very nice picture there is there on his FIFA 14 card and um, he looks like a very nice card he's maintained his rating from FIFA 13 and I'm looking forward to using this absolute beast of a player and um, that pretty much summarizes this video guys so if you guys want to use this website I'll put a link in the description below and um, that's it for this video guys if you enjoyed a like would be appreciated until next time have a nice day and bye